My grandfather started the Chevrolet business with a partner in 1917 in San Francisco on Van Ness Avenue, and it was called Anderson Smith uh, Chevrolet. Van Ness was the main location, but he had nine other sales spots, like little gas stations, all over the city of San Francisco. There were some good years and some not so good years, but um, the depression is what really killed him. And he lost everything. And uh, they uh, closed the store, they, they had nothing. Uh, my grandfather and grandmother got in their car with their uh, with my dad and my aunt, and they drove down to Southern California in a Rolls Royce. Rolls Royce. But they didn't have money to buy anything. They had to rent a, uh, an apartment when they got down here. But a fellow by the name of Golden put them into business in Glendale in the Dodge Plymouth business. So my dad changed the name from Smith Golden Dodge to Bob Smith Dodge Plymouth in uh, 1951. In 1963, he sold the Dodge store in Glendale to his used car manager and uh, moved to Hollywood uh, and uh, opened Volkswagen, Porsche. Volkswagen business had declined terribly in the United States. Uh, so we closed VW and Porsche and we came up to Toyota in 93 and, and, and uh, it was a struggle, really a struggle. We bought a, a dealership that was, we didn't realize uh, was struggling as much as it was in the community. And I remember it like it was yesterday. I'm sitting in my office and Peter calls and he says, Dad, I'm ready to come to work. We're moving west. Why well, I, 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 I think this drawer doesn't work because I broke it when I jumped up so high. <laughs> I had always um, wanted to be in the car business. Uh, we had a lot of fun, and that was just a goal of mine. Is I had to at least give it a try, and it was definitely something I had to do, and I wanted to do it early, early on. At any rate, we're here and we're struggling for a couple of years and Peter's phone call was like putting a rocket into our business and he comes out here and uh, after a couple of years we had turned the corner and uh, you know here we are almost 24 years later thriving in the community. I think he knew we'd be here in 100 years celebrating because my brother is still very going strong out in uh, Calabasas with BMW and Mini. Our business is changing rapidly. And it feels like it's changing every six months. So hopefully we'll lay the groundwork so that it is here for the, uh, another hundred years.